I think my, my first incarnation of, of working in partnership with the Confucius Institute, I was working at Hume Community Garden Centre and I'd been working on a project within Manchester University. It was at that point we had a discussion around the design of, of community gardens and spaces where people can grow their own fruits within a communal space and we started some workshops looking at the, the elements of Chinese gardens and, and the importance of them to, to people and obviously the Confucius Institute in, in that respect. And it, it was lovely to see new people coming in and sharing the space within the garden centre. And part of the garden's design we did was a moon gate out of Willow and as you can see just behind me over here I've got some cuttings from the, the Willow Arch that we did at the Hume Garden Centre. So that legacy of, of sharing cuttings and plants with friends and other communities is, is for me a, a big legacy. It's a good way for well-being because it hits all of the five key elements of well-being, you're learning something new, you're nurturing something on a daily basis and you can propagate from it and then you can share that with your friends as well. We open the doors and we've welcomed lots and lots of different people in from all over the world. It's a good leveller, you know, everyone comes in, they look at nature, nature's all around the world so no matter what part of the planet you come from, there is always something around you that's growing. Um, and you can share that experience and looking at, at where some of the plants that we've got in, in uh, the gardens here come from and then find, trace those origins back to you know, where, where they originated from in China. And I did an experiment, so I gave people a piece of chalk and I said write hello and welcome in your native language and by the end of the day we'd had 13 different languages written on the, uh, on the tarmac at the front of the cafe. So for me it was lovely to see those differences but also see the strong similarities in people enjoying the, the outdoors and, and nature.